FNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. Here the Dow Industrial trading up 181. Nasdaq's up 122. S and P's up 22. Gold gold contract up 21 dollars 90 trading at 1980 an ounce. We have silver up. Uh, look at that move. 85 cents, 24 dollars 38 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude down a buck 39. 71 dollars 13 cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. Ten year note. Up 16 ticks, trading 113.23 to 30. Up a full point, plus four ticks at 127.20 and king dollar. King dollar taking it on the chin, down 748 ticks, 103,350. The euro is at 107. The yen is at 138. And the British pound is at 125 to 1 US dollar. It is a melt up, folks. That's the bottom line. We go over and take a look at the S&P. So what do we have out here today? It's going to be, okay, so we're at 41 million shares. Last high up here was 70. So you're not going to get the volume, but the bottom line is that you're at higher price. Yeah, you haven't basically hit that high yet. And this thing still wants 431, and right now you're at 428. We go into the NDX, the three Qs. We take a look at the three Qs. Same type of setup in the three Qs, except it's a lot higher price in the Qs. It wants 371. And it would have been better, actually. This is what's intriguing here about the three Qs. We came down with monster volume yesterday. Now, it would have been better you know, if it actually got underneath that today before it starts going higher, and it didn't. So this is, uh, you know, you could say it's a toss-up, but my take is this thing is actually going to somehow get to that 371. And let's go look at King Dollar, because if King Dollar does fail here, this is going to get intriguing. You know, King Dollar, I'm looking for that 106, but this baby turned, and we turned at the 0.76. So that's going to be really, you know, bottom line is that, you know, that now that's saying when you point when you turn at a 618 or higher, you're not going to go break the bottom out. But, you know, this is the second time. This is wide price spread on the way down. That's a big number. And that's why you see the, the market going higher once again. We go into the 10 year Treasury. We take a look at the Treasury. These want higher price, lower yield. And what the Treasury did do. So we had that big wide price spread yesterday. It was coming into lighter volume. Now what you have out here today is that you actually do have lighter volume, rejection of lower price, that's as high as we go. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.